Hi everybody, Beanmeister22 here, and this is really creepy. Alright, so this is our brown widow spider. Lays really weird egg sacs, and she has been cranking them out. We have had her, man, it's been less than a month, and she has already cranked out five egg sacs. Very weird. Alright, so what we have here is... Our brown widow spider has laid two more egg sacs, and she is just cranking these out. If you remember, we made that one big container, and we put in a at least two black widow egg sacs, brown widow egg sacs, false black widow egg sacs, and two praying mantis egg cases. We double sealed it up, so it's a sealed Lord of the Flies, Lord of the Spiders sort of thing, and we'll let them work it out amongst themselves. Showed you that video before. So I'm making a similar habitat, but I'm just putting two brown widow egg sacs in there. We'll get these egg sacs in here, and when they hatch, they will just be brown widow spiders. I am sealing this up just like I did with the other one. Remember, we put the lid on there, and I wasn't really quite sure if that was enough, so I double-lidded it and really just taped the heck out of it with electrical tape, and it's a sealed environment. If these egg cases hatch, um, I don't know why they wouldn't, but we haven't had any brown widow spiders egg cases, you know, hatching yet. If and when they hatch, since we just have brown widows in here, once they're done eating each other and there's a couple left, hopefully they will grow big enough, and then maybe we can separate one out, put it in its own habitat. When you have spider babies, and we've shown this in other videos, you get so many in there, they eat each other, they mess back and forth, and one or two will get bigger than the others. But until they eliminate all their competition, you cannot open the container because these little spider baby monsters could, you know, go everywhere. So it really has to be a sealed environment for safety purposes.
right on back. Here's the problem now. Like I said, it's been less than four weeks, three and a half weeks. The Brown Widow laid a fifth egg case. That's five egg cases in under a month. Wow. And since we've already sealed up that special Brown Widow habitat for the spider babies, I don't know what to do with this one. I'm going to have to probably destroy it. I mean, none of the other ones have hatched, so I could probably unseal that. But once you seal something, there's no reason to break the seal. I mean, that, that's a done deal. So we're going to have to start uh, getting rid of these again. We're going to seal them up in tape and just, uh, yeah. Or protocol zero. And I'll tell you this. From a few months ago, not even believing or knowing that brown widow spiders existed, I have a newfound respect. I don't want to say respect. I don't want to say I have a newfound respect for them. I have a <laughs> fear. <laughs> it's These things are cranking out the spider babies like it's nobody's business. One brown widow, five egg cases with, what, 100 to 150 spider babies inside. Talk about an infestation. If you had this spider loose in your bedroom in one month, bam, five egg cases. So what does that mean? A month after that, bam, five, six, seven hundred tiny little spiders. Wow, these are very prolific spiders. And man, they know how to multiply. <laughs> All right, so leave your comments in the comment section. As always, thanks for watching. Meister 22, the most dangerous man on YouTube.